You're watching NBC 25 Sports. It was an eventful offseason for the Central Michigan football program. One former player was arrested. The team was nominated for an ESPY. Their former head coach, Dan Enos, left abruptly for an offensive coordinator position. And then they hired a new head coach with no previous head coaching experience in John Bonamago. Change is in the air in Mount Pleasant, and this afternoon, the team hit the practice field for the first time in 2015. One of the biggest challenges facing this team initially will be adjusting to their new head coach and any changes he intends to make on either side of the ball, but the players already seem comfortable in their new surroundings. There's still a lot of similarities. I, you know, Coach Ryzen's still along with us, um, our position coach, so that's, you know, that's kind of a, something that we use you know, as a you know, something comforting. It's, it's definitely an adjustment um, for sure to get a new coach coming in, but we, we went through all spring ball with the new coaches and we're pretty pretty acclimated to the adjustment now, so we're good to go. We just know people got to step up. We know young guys got to step up. We know, uh, you know, we got we got people that have left. We got seniors that we got great seniors that left last year. We got some people that went down, either was, you know, some unfortunate events or some injuries. We just need people to step up and I feel like we're going to get that from people. So. Let's take a look at CMU's schedule this year. They will do most of their heavy lifting in the sea early in the season as they take on Oklahoma State, Syracuse, and Michigan State all in the month of September. Then they get into the heart of conference play. Three of their first five conference games are on the road. Then they finish out the year at Kent State and at home against East.